Hey, you know, when you're hosting all the holiday festivities at your home and time is of the essence. Hey, we got turkeys to do. We got ham to do in the oven. Hey, I'm about to show you a way to do candied sweet potatoes when time is of the essence, y'all. Hey, so with that said, slap on your gloves, grab your tools of choice, and hey, meet me in your kitchen, y'all. Hey, I wanna welcome you back to my channel. I am your man. Keep a cup can cook. And hey, I know you read the title, but I'm telling you, y'all, when time is of the essence, I'm about to show you the greatest tip you ever seen. Hey, you know we doing candy sweet potatoes. I got my flame right here. It's on the low flame. Or my pot is on the low flame. How about that? Got me one stick. Unsalted butter going in. You want to allow that, that, that heat to go ahead and begin to melt your butter down. And at the same time, what we got right here, I got me two tablespoons of cinnamon. I got me a teaspoon of ginger, ground ginger. I got me a teaspoon of allspice. And then I got a, a teaspoon and a half of nutmeg, y'all, going in. Cause I want to get my spices in there kind of early so they could just begin to blossom. Are you listening to me? You want to get these spices going as soon as you can. Cause you want to wake them up, y'all. You want to get them to blossom. You want to get, get them to become fragrant in your kitchen, y'all. Especially during the holidays. Hey, if you walk in somebody's house during the holidays and you don't smell no, no seasonings, blossom, turn around and go on back home and get your own meal together. Hey, but hey, I'm giving you a tip. I'm saving you some time right here. Ah, yeah. All right, we got that going in. We got everything beginning to blossom up. The kitchen is smelling good already. And we ain't got really started yet, y'all. But hey, this is the foundation for some great old fashioned candy sweet potatoes. All right, now, what I got right here, I got three quarters of a cup. That's that light brown sugar right there, y'all. We're going to go in with it. Three quarters of a cup. Light brown sugar. I'm gonna go ahead and increase my heat from this low to a medium. I don't mess around and cut it all the way off by mistake. There we go. We want it on a medium flame right now. We're gonna get the granules from the brown sugar to get melted down. And you know me, y'all. I got a twist for you. I got a twist. It's gonna bring all of this together. All right, now, what I got right here, y'all, I got me the juice from two lemons. I mean, I'm sorry, from two oranges. The juice from two oranges. Remember, I, I brought the temperature up to a medium flame. That helps to dissolve those crystals from that brown sugar as well, y'all. Now right here, y'all, go hand to hand right here. Now this is raisins that I've been soaking in rum for four to five days right here, y'all. I guarantee you, y'all, if you taste one of these bad boy, oh my goodness, good. But you don't want the kids with this right here. Now, this is the residual 
of the soaking for my raisins. I'm gonna go on here and add that in there. Oh, you're gonna see these raisins again, y'all. You're gonna see the raisins again. And now we wanna add us some vanilla extract. Nice teaspoon, vanilla extract. Small pinch of salt. Then I got me a cup, y'all. White granulated sugar going in. I did say candy sweet potatoes, right? Just making sure. Yeah. Okay, now what you want to do, because we want to introduce you to the star of the show. There they go, y'all. That's those sweet potatoes that we were talking about. Hey, I cut them all. And look at the ridges, y'all. Look, hey, we, we pulling off all, all the stops for the holiday, y'all. We got the ruffle effect on our potatoes, y'all. Oh my goodness, y'all. I'm bringing the game way up, y'all. Bringing the game way up. Okay, we just wanna introduce those to our sauce right here. Remember, y'all, sweet potatoes packs a lot of water in them. So, as we bring, put these in, we're going to stir them around, get them all lubricated in that good sauce, all that good candiness. They're going to begin to release their waters. They're going to begin to steam, y'all, and cook. I'm saving you some time in the kitchen, y'all. Saving you some, some time in that oven. I'm teaching you, y'all, how to bring the holiday treats in a time-effective way. All right, once we got these bad boys lubricated in this good candy sauce right here, what you want to do, we're going to bump the heat up to a medium high flame now. Make sure your pot is sitting on there nicely as well. All right, got my flame up to a medium high. We want to pop that veil on because we want to create some steam, y'all. Make sure you get that vent hole away from your body, y'all. Because I'm telling you, as the medium high temp comes up to, to its intensity, it's going to build that steam and that steam is going to spew out of here, y'all. So like I said, them sweet potatoes is packed with water. I am your man once again. Come on. Keep a cup can cook. Hey, we doing it, y'all. Candy. Sweet potatoes on top of the stove. And I'll be back. Are you listening to me? See that steam coming out of there? You want to pop that open, break it away from you, let the condensation run down, then pull it. Give it a nice little stir. See the liquid, how it came up? That's because these sweet potatoes, y'all, they full of water. So we were we bringing that water out of them, y'all. We're going to let these bad boys cook. Steam. Pop 
that veil back on. Make sure that vent hole is away from you. And we looking for our sweet potatoes to become what? You guessed it. Two pick tender, y'all. I am your man once again. And I'll be back. We gonna bring them candy sweet potatoes to the forefront. That's right, another holiday idea. All right, since this is a holiday holiday idea, y'all, and I got my family, hey, I might as well invite all of my family, y'all. Hey, check these bad boys out. Check these bad boys out. We're gonna give them a nice little stir, but we wanna check the tenderness of these. Although I could tell from how my spatula rolls around them that they tender, y'all. But we want to check the toothpick tenderness of them anyway, y'all. While you listening to me, can't even, oh my goodness, y'all. Goes right through there like butter. Come on, y'all. Hey, I'm giving you a, saving you some time, y'all, on the holidays. Now, with that said, we want to lower the temperature to a low flame. We want to bring it back down to a low flame. And remember, I said we used the juice of two oranges. Well, I got the zest of one orange right here, y'all. At this time, we want to go in with that zest. Then we want to go in with our raisins that's been soaked. Oh my goodness, y'all. Oh my goodness. We want to give it a nice little stir. Nice little fold it. Fold it, y'all. Don't stir. Fold it. Okay, now at this time, what we're going to do, we're going to move this over to the side. We're still on that little flame, y'all. Got my dish. This is my casserole dish that I plan to bring to the table, y'all. Notice it's not butter, it's not sprayed because we're not putting it in the oven. We're saving space, right? So, we're gonna go ahead and put these bad boys, take them out. Slide a spoon. Throw that thumb up in the air for me, y'all. We doing it, y'all. Holiday ideas. Holiday ideas. Okay, now. Once you have removed, oh, of your sweet potatoes, you got the reserve sauce right there. We want to bring it up to a high flame, y'all, because we're going to reduce it down to a nice glaze. And yet, yeah, you want to stir it. that it don't stick, making sure it don't stick. And while this is in your pan, it's still hot. We wanna add some more sweetness, y'all. I told you we are doing candy, sweet potatoes, y'all. We got some cinnamon sugar, y'all. Just gonna hit them up with some more sweetness, y'all. Why not? Why not? Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah. I just want to go ahead and give this a few minutes. 
it's going to begin to reduce down and thicken up. Take your time with it and enjoy what you're doing, y'all. Can you see the consistency? We're pulling out all the stops for this year right here, y'all. We got us an election year. We got us newfound holiday ideas. Man, we get ready to do it, y'all. We get ready to do it. All right, when you get it to the consistency that you're looking for, go ahead and cut your heat and a lot of residual heat to do the rest. Oh, yeah, I'm loving it, y'all. And like I said, if you're loving it, y'all, definitely hit me up with that thumb in the air, y'all. When we do, I'm going to go ahead and scoop this out the camera. Then we about to hit that, hit this bad boy up with this glaze, y'all. Ain't nothing but, I did say candy, sweet potatoes, right? Look at that candy goodness right there. With the rum raisins. Oh my goodness. Oh, that candy goodness. With those rum raisins. Can you imagine putting that on your plate, putting that on your table for any holiday, y'all? For any holiday. Come on, y'all. You got to give me the thumbs up on that right there. Come on. That's it right there, y'all. But you know me. Still got another spin. Why not? <laughs> Come on, y'all. Give it up. Give it up, y'all. Give it up, y'all. Give it up, y'all. Then, huh. There you have it, y'all. Keep a cup can cook style. Candy, sweet potatoes. Now, if you're new to my channel, hey, I definitely need you. Yeah. Hit that subscribe button for me, and I need everybody, y'all, to go out and hit that notification bell that you're notified every time your man keep a cup. Can cook, they're dropping another video on you, y'all. And hey, once again, I'm gonna give you one last gander, and you know what I'm about to do. I'm going to say my thank yous and my goodbyes. Another holiday idea. Candy sweet potato.